Prime Minister Dr. Timothy Harris stated that the people of St. Kitts and Nevis need the citizens and residents to seize all opportunities for nation building and that as a people we should look to our own ingenuity and industry to contribute to our own development. He was speaking at his annual New Year's Gala last Saturday. St. Kitts and Nevis needs its citizens and residents to seize all opportunities for nation building. And it is still true that in the face of mountain challenges and the topsy-turviness of the times, we must as a people look to our own ingenuity and industry to advance and contribute to our own development. He then said that making history is nothing for the Team Unity government and that the historic coming together of rival political parties, putting country above self, has truly been one of the accomplishments. Was an historic first in the manner and care in which the movement was founded. Today, that historic coming together of rival political parties putting our country and people above self and party has been one of the truly historic accomplishments of the Team Unity movement. Meanwhile, keynote speaker at the gala, Sir Dennis Byron, former president of the Caribbean Court of Justice, said that the historical quest for unity has been long and often a struggle to give meaningful substance to the underlying desire of the people to come together for a common purpose. The historical quest for unity has been long and often a fitful struggle to give meaningful substance to the underlying desire of our people to tap into our potential and come together towards a common purpose. He then stated that in the Commonwealth Caribbean, our history is still evident in political cultures and institutions. The Prime Minister's Gala saw entertainment from famed reggae artist Grams Morgan of Morgan Heritage. I am Chiari Morton for SKN Newsline.